hi guys it's Hani here welcome to my youtube channel today i prepared for you a beautiful colorful tutorial we're going to make these gorgeous royal icing butterflies so let's get started first technique is showing how to make piped royal icing butterflies i place a piece of wax paper over my template and i'm using 15 second consistency royal icing Royal icing butterflies are particularly beautiful when decorated with wet on wet techniques. This basically means that you're adding icing to wet icing, creating either marble designs or you're just blending it in or making polka dots. I'm going to ice top wings first and then we're gonna let those crust and then we'll finish the bottom wings. While the wings are crusting, you can work on other butterflies. And I'm just going to slide my wax paper with top wings on a side. I'm not gonna lift it up and then I will slide it back in over my template and decorate the bottom wings. Once you are done decorating bottom wings, just slide it out and don't mess with it for at least an hour or so until you have a thick crust developed. This way you don't get any hairline cracks in your icing. And then I actually like to use a wide cookie spatula to transfer these onto a flat tray, tray and um, I let them dry overnight you can also use a parchment I however find maybe it's just the brand of the parchment I'm using that once uh, these are dry they literally fly off the parchment so you have to be rather careful so you don't drop them accidentally from wax paper I find like I have to really like peel the wax paper from the royal icing And one thing I didn't mention, you can make these ahead of time. And when I say ahead of time, months in advance, you can store these flat like this and then you can shape them um, day before you need them on a shaping tray. Now I'm going to make, I think this is probably the most popular butterfly of all, Monarch butterfly using yellow, orange and black 15 second consistency royal icing. Now take the needle tool and shape it around the edges and also drag it in the center like so. And for all the recipes, tools, and templates, visit my blog. I posted all the tools and recipes and templates on there.
this one is probably my favorite I used royal blue food coloring and I added just a touch of black to it to mute it down once you're done piping all the wings you're gonna have to again let them dry completely before we can shape these butterflies and we're gonna be shaping these on a tray so you can just take a um, cardstock paper and fold it in half and then fold the halves in half and we're going to nest these onto the tray again I'm using a piece of wax paper you can just reuse the paper from the butterfly pipe a thin line of piping consistency royal icing and glue both wings and then shape it on a tray and let it dry overnight and then you can just peel off the backing and your butterflies are ready and if you don't have time to create piped real icing butterflies you can also make stencil butterflies make a stencil and use stiff real icing you can then decorate it with sprinkles jewel dust while the icing is wet obviously you can create also some fun marble designs you can't really create wet on wet designs but the, that doesn't make these any less beautiful and they are really really quick to make so if you are in a hurry you can make these in no time you can also airbrush these to give them a little more interest and we're gonna follow the same step of gluing each wing onto a thick line and then shape them like this you can also turn them upside down and draw on them it's easier to draw on the smooth side because the top side is a bit rough and then you can outline with black piping consistency royal icing and again you can make these wings ahead of time and store them like this in a container in an airtight container and then glue them um, or create uh, shape the butterfly when you need it it's easier to store these like this when they are flat once you shape the butterfly there is a higher risk of them breaking and if you want to you can add another layer just to accentuate the body a little bit and that's how you can make beautiful colorful royal icing butterflies I hope you find this tutorial useful guys be sure to let me know what you think in the comment section down below and if you use my tutorials for your project don't forget to share the pictures with me or you can tag me on Instagram I'd love to see what you guys create. Thank you so much for watching. And again, for all the tools and recipes, visit my blog. Link is in the description box under the video. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time.